The rainfall total continued to climb for coastal Texas, either 1,100 or just, just about, just about 1,300 and over 1,300, all all-time U.S. storm rainfall records. For an update, we go now to this clip from CNN. A humanitarian crisis unfolding in the Houston metropolitan area. Evacuations continue as water rises. We were checking it all night long at 3 a.m. when I looked the last time. It wasn't even up to my front door. And by 5 o'clock, we had two inches of water in the house. Tens of thousands in shelters amid catastrophic flooding brought by record rainfall. I had to grab and my baby and uh, diapers, what I could, and try to swim and hopefully hope that we could be picked up. When we was out there on that, on that roof, um, sun, Sunday and Monday, that water was coming in so fast, and then we got rescued on that bridge, and they, they tell us that that bridge has collapsed it. Many more still waiting to be rescued as emergency crews and volunteers race against time to reach those still trapped in their homes. We had situations of rescuing people out of attics, uh, people with medical condition, uh, elderly people, uh, all different types of situations with animals, uh, kids, babies. I'm a former U.S. Navy search and rescue swimmer, so I'm just compelled to come out when things like this are happening. Harris County's Flood District meteorologist says that enough water has fallen to cover the entire 1,800 square miles of Harris County with 33 inches of water. Oh, my goodness, that's, well, that's two feet for, for us. Uh, this is where this uh, system is heading. It's going to continue along the Louisiana border for the foreseeable future, and then it will make its way up the Mississippi River Valley on.